Today's lesson slice is Newton's three laws of motion with real life reflections. The first law of motion, the law of inertia. The law of inertia states that a body at rest will continue to be at rest, and a body in constant motion will continue to be in constant motion along a straight line unless acted on by a net external. Inertia is the tendency of the body to resist any change in its motion. Mass is the measure of inertia. The greater the mass of an object, the greater the inertia. If the forces acting on an object are balanced, the object will either be at rest or in constant motion along a straight line. Reflect on this, the criticism you receive from others can either drag you down or push you up, just like an object that feels a push or pull. How do you respond to criticism from others as a way to improve yourself? Lesson Slice If changing an object's present state of motion requires an outside force. Similarly, hearing other people's perspectives could help us change the way we see things. Newton's Second Law of Motion The Law of Acceleration The Law of Acceleration states that acceleration is directly proportional to the force and is inversely proportional to the mass. It means, the greater the force, the greater is its acceleration. The greater the mass, the lesser the acceleration. Reflect on this, take a moment to consider whether you are giving each area of your life equal attention. In that case, what area of your life still needs work? Lesson Slice Just like the inverse relationship of mass and acceleration, to have a happier life, you should figure out how to free yourself of burdens. You will be happier and more optimistic if you have less stress and burden. Newton's Third Law of Motion, The Law of Interaction The Law of Interaction or the Law of Action and Reaction, states that for every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. Action and reaction forces do not cancel each other because they act on separate bodies. They act simultaneously and are equal in magnitudes but opposite in direction. Reflect on this, unlike action and reaction forces that happen simultaneously, your obligations and responsibilities do not always happen simultaneously. When everything you have to do happens all at once, how do you handle it all? Lesson Slice, just like action and reaction forces, there is a corresponding response to every action. Sometimes choosing no action is also a reaction. There are circumstances in your life that could cause you to respond impulsively or violently. Remember that we always have a choice in how we react to circumstances so that we may handle them successfully and calmly whenever they arise. In summary, Newton's three laws of motions are the laws of inertia, acceleration and interaction. Observe how it can happen to your everyday life and apply its principles. Don't be afraid to learn one lesson one slice at a time. Visit us at www.lessonslesses.com